The FIFA World Cup in France was a tournament which saw a number of fine individual strikes. There was Michael Owen's goal for England against Argentina. Dennis Bergkamp's last-minute stunner against the same opposition. And the goal from Croatia's Devil Schuker, whose own solo effort rounded off a highly impressive 3-0 quarter-final win against Germany. Croatia made it to the FIFA World Cup as an independent nation for the first time in 1998 and quickly took the tournament by storm. Spearheaded by the prolific Devil Schuker, with Robert Prozhenecki pulling the strings in midfield, they made it all the way to the semi-finals, where they suffered a narrow defeat to eventual winners France. We used to watch the games near our school, all of the World Cup matches. I remember that semi-final when Schuker scored against France. We jumped and celebrated so much. Then just as we looked back up, Duram had equalised to make it 1-1. It was very sad for sure, but major pride as well when we took the bronze in the third place playoff against the Netherlands. Unforgettable days. Returning to Schuker's goal against Germany in the quarterfinals, as Croatia win the free kick, the forward is already in space and calling for the ball. Meanwhile, sweeper Igor Stimak makes a late run from his own half, which catches the German defenders unawares. Before his header, Schuker is alert enough to take a step back to stay on side, and his first touch takes him into the box. Heinrich's momentum as he attempts to get back is then used against him, as Schuker cleverly changes direction. From a narrow angle, he shoots inside, wrong-footing the keeper as it goes through his legs and into the net. Schuker scored six goals at the tournament, which were enough to see him take home the golden boot. But more importantly, they helped announce Croatia's arrival on football's world stage, setting a template for future Croatian teams to follow.